News First continues on WKYT and WIMT after Kentucky Derby winner Barbaro suffered that horrible injury at the Preakness. The surgeon who repaired his multiple fractures became a worldwide hero. Amazing what they were able to do. As Denny Treese tells us, there's a doctor here in central Kentucky who's been saving severely injured horses for years with, with prosthetics. We should warn you that this story does contain some potentially disturbing images, but it does have a happy ending. Barbaro's being pulled up! If Barbaro's injuries had resulted in an irreversible loss of circulation in that lower limb, the only options would have been euthanasia or amputation. And the latter is where Dr. Rick Redden and his International Center for Equine Podiatry come in. And amputation is becoming a, a very valid option for a lot of people. I really see no reason this can't be done routinely. You can actually make a temporary in about five minutes if you've got a good shot. After collaborating on a couple of amputations and prosthetic fittings with the famed Dr. Barry Grant from Washington State, Dr. Redden took the science even further. I had, a, had enough uh, encouragement from him to, uh, to, to go over the total different procedure, and since then I've done about 40 cases. I mean, we've got six or eight of them out there that are still doing very well. About 10 years ago, Dr. Redden put a prosthesis on a stallion that was then able to continue breeding. Five months after uh, the procedure, he was covering his marriage, and to this day, he still covers his marriage live. This mare behind me has kind of become the poster child for the new procedure that Dr. Redden developed in 1992. It's been a very revolutionary idea because I now graft a piece of frog from another foot on the same horse onto the stump, and uh, that's given this mare almost 15 years of being pretty happy. Dr. Redden showed me the difference between what a normal foot looks like and this one after the mare was chased by a pack of dogs and slid into a guide wire that severed her entire digit. This is the frog graft and uh, we just trimmed the thing a couple of days ago. A permanent prosthesis costs anywhere from three to five thousand dollars. The whole process costs a minimum of twenty thousand and can run upwards of a hundred thousand. So the good doctor tells owners if money is an object they probably shouldn't consider this. But oh the rewards. The first day I turned her out, she ran harder than any horse on the farm. And probably that was the most uh, exciting time of my whole veterinary career, to see this three-legged marriage just ripping and tearing through the paddock like a normal horse. Most people see them being just total cripples, you know, and poor little things. But any horse owner who sees this sees the possibilities. There's nothing else just to be happy. In Woodford County, Denny Trees, WKYT 27 News First. All right, some uh, wonderful work certainly going on there oh, for I know. sure. I'd love to be able to see that horse, that happy ending yeah, there, absolutely. galloping off, a great thing. And a happy ending to this day, really. It's a nice evening out there, TG. It has worked out okay. Now